This is Sports 5 TV talking to the Vuna Polar brothers. Uh, thanks for talking to us. A few questions for you. Uh, Sarri suffered a late defeat at the hands of Exeter yesterday, denting top four hopes. You face the Welsh in the final round. Still confident of making the top four? Yeah, definitely. I think we got to go into this weekend. Hopefully we can get the win. But um, we know it's a big performance needed and uh, we are obviously gutted about the result yesterday. But no, we, got, we can't just uh, rest on our laurels. We've got to move on now and uh, big week ahead and we got to do what we can to control what we can. Uh, I think definitely, yeah. Um, like you said, we've just got a big week ahead of us and um, uh, we've got to try and beat Welsh um, by as many points as we can and try and force ourselves back into the top four. And Saracens lost to Saints in the final of the Premiership last year, uh, as well as in the European final. Does that make you extra determined this year? Yeah, it definitely gives you a bit more motivation. I think um, getting the two finals, not winning any trophies. Um, I was uh, involved in the first final, but not the second one. But no, it was, just, it was both uh, hard to watch. And um, no, well, hopefully it gives us motivation, but it doesn't really mean anything if we don't perform on the weekend. And a World Cup year. How excited are you to be participating in a home nations tournament? Yeah, obviously very excited by the prospect, but that's what it is right now is prospect. And I think there's uh, bigger and, um, and uh, closer things we have to worry about right now, uh, especially you know the game this week. And uh, like I said, trying to force ourselves into the top four. And then hopefully, um, hopefully we get looking for the thing in the squad. And finishing second again in the Six Nations, um, do you think this has helped motivate you ahead of the World Cup? I think so. It gives us that extra push. I think um, we've been uh, consistent the last couple of years, but we'd, we're definitely guided not to be uh, to not to have won uh, the Six Nations. But um, I think coming into camp this year, I think boys will be extra motivated and hopefully it gives us uh, the edge. Pool A with Australia and Wales. Uh, do you feel um, the anticipation? Uh, because you've beaten them both recently, uh, you should do it again. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I'm not going to sit here and be like, we're definitely going to get out the group, but it gives us the confidence to, to go out there and hopefully um, execute whatever the coaches want us to and um, beat them. Uh, what And what are your views on uh, selection of overseas players? Obviously, more competition for yourselves, but could that work in favour uh, of sides providing more competition? Yeah, I think so. I think it uh, definitely helps with better players being involved in international. I think that's the highest level. Well, everyone wants to be involved in international level and um, it definitely brings more competition for teams like England and uh, you see team, more teams like Scotland now and Italy bringing in uh, overseas players. But for us, it's just the best players playing international is always better for the game. Brilliant chatting to you, lads. All the best yeah. with the World Cup. Thank you very much.